All right, so uh, this is what you guys been searching for on YouTube. How big do blueberry plants grow? Recent audience activity. And I have done how to plant blueberries over here. Done the blueberry bushes, how to grow them. I also done that one. And how big do blueberry bushes grow? Well, I'm gonna answer that today. All right, thank you for watching the Blue Garden channel. Hey, welcome to the Blue Garden. So, some of the questions were, how tall do blueberries grow? Well, they have to grow to six feet tall. You can see this one grows up to six feet. And, See, there's a, a blueberry there. And these are called um, high bush. All right. So, and this is a uh, misty in, um, and I believe, uh, let's take a look at the label here. What does that say? Jubilee. All right, this is Jubilee. Here's a Misty, that I do know. And then, uh, oh, there's other ones there. I can't find a tag on that one, but uh, it should be uh, here, uh, O'Neill, I believe. You can see the leaves here are dark, and you can see these are lighter, with the berries. So these are Southern High Bush. So they grow about six feet tall. And over here we have a, a Belia Emerald. And you can see this one is about, uh, I don't know, four feet. If you want to tag that one, about four feet. And can't find the label on that one. Uh oh, you see this? Look, walking by, oh gosh. And they get broken. See that? And then look. And then they uh, dry up because it was broken. This is because you're walking by here too many times. Uh, the branch got... Bro oh, that was a bee buzzing my head. So we have to be careful. Ah, that's the second one. Here's the other one. So you gotta inspect it. But again, how tall do blueberries grow? This is about four feet. That's uh, six feet over there. And uh, let's see over here. Now these are just planted about a year. Where did that cat go? He took off on me. You can see this is only about a foot. And this is uh, the emerald. And you hear the cat? Meow. Where'd he go? And then here we have, uh, what do we have here? I can't get it. Jubilee. And you can see here it's about a foot high. There's a cat somewhere over there. And then over here we have have a jewel. So a jewel. And you can see the height is about I didn't say a foot. So you just see, you just trim it on the top so it won't grow high up and it'll spread out. And, or you could get, these are all southern bush, high bush. So Jubilee and Emerald. You can see how the top crown is cut off so it will spread out long ways, latitude, instead of vertically. And uh, so to answer your question, how high do blueberry bush grow? Well, 
these are some high bush. They grow up to six feet tall. But if you cut the, the crown on the top, they would just grow lengthwise. If you leave these crowns out here, it will grow tall like the other one I showed you over there. You see this one? They're all about a foot. So you can control the height of your blueberries by cutting off the crown so it doesn't branch up more. So you can see here how it, this one's kind of drooping down and this one is an emerald I believe and look at the size of that. See that? Look at that berry. Oh, I hear the cat somewhere over there. How did he get over here? Look at the size of that berry. All right, so I hope that answers your question. How high do blueberry bush grow? And to grow as high as one foot, four feet, and these are all southern high bush. And the maximum is six feet tall. This one's six feet tall, you can see here. We got another one here. This is, uh, I believe, O'Neill. And you can see this one's growing about six feet tall as well. <laughs> see that? Look at that bushel there. So those are growing up. That's fairly, it's a two year bush. And then we have some more over here. Right here. And you see, these are mid season. So that's why they have no flowers. I mean, yeah, no flowers or leaves. But you can see that all the buds are, are there. Mid season. And you can see how tall this one's already growing. See this? That's about, I don't know, about five feet tall. So you can see your southern high bushes can grow six feet maxima. All right, so I hope that answers your question. And let me give you a little bonus around here. Our Thompson grape. Look at that. Thompson grape. Look at that. That's a bonus round. Look at that. Now, if you want to know how to grow grapes, you know where to go. The Blue Garden. Look at that bushel. There's another one. There's another one. There's another one. There's another one. And we're still growing more down here. So, this is the bonus round. Now, this is the baby grape. And this is uh, purple. Purple. And then look at that. There. There. Down here. In there. How about there? There. There. Look at that. They're everywhere. Like I said, if you want to learn how to grow grapes, come to the Blue Garden. This is just a bonus round. Over here. More. And then look at over here. Right there. And look, even more. See, even inside there, look at that long one there. So, all right, there's your bonus round. This is not a baby anymore. It's fully impregnated with grapes. Look at that. All right. So you can see the three wire system, one, two, and three. And 
see how it's attached to wires. All right, so like I said, the grapes are doing great. The blueberries, this is just a bonus round for you guys. Blueberries come in uh, high bush and low bush. But you have to take your uh, high bush and turn it into a low bush. If I would just cut it here, which I will never do. And it'll only grow that high. Because the more higher, taller it is, guess what? The more of these you get. All right, so, oh, I want to announce new video coming out tomorrow. So this one is just a bonus, putting it out today to let you know. Tomorrow, we talk about how we plant that nectarine plant and also about blueberries. But what's in the soil here? What do I put in the soil? All right, stay tuned for that. Tomorrow, Thursday, and another video coming out the following Thursday at 11 a.m. Hey, welcome to the Blue Garden. I just finished uploading the video of how we plant, how we planted this in a pot, the nectarine tree. So I had to break it up in two parts, part one and part two. So they're coming out this Thursday, part one, Thursday at 11 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. And part two next Thursday at 11 o'clock in the morning, Pacific Standard Time. Yeah. All right, I hope you watched the video. And it's a new addition here to, at the Blue Garden. Lay down your comments and let me know what you think. Recovery this flat. Unemployment has been at 9.5% or above for 14 months. Congress did something that it's never done before. It extended unemployment benefits to 99 weeks. That cost more than $100 billion, a huge expense for a government in debt. But now, for many Americans, 99 weeks have passed, and there is still no job in sight. Hey, welcome to the Blue Garden. Hey, got a little situation here. I need your help. All right. The company I used to work for for the past three years shut down. The, the corporate greed and and investors and everything decided that it's too expensive to uh, do business here in Southern California. So they shut down the plant. It used to make elevator components. I was uh, in charge of many jobs there. I was uh, the tuning supervisor. I was the sub pumps inspector and I was uh, the facility manager meaning anything breaks anything happens to the facility I was in charge of it and tuning inspector I was in charge of the whole machine shop department and sub pump inspector when they assembled the final pump I was the guy who inspected, made sure all the parts and components were working and operational before they shipped it out to the customer. So I was doing the job of three different people, one salary. And the greedy corporations, they shut down the whole plant. And they diversify all the jobs and the equipment to their Sacramento plant and Illinois. And they laid off everybody. And I was the first to go because I was over 55. Everybody who was 55 and older or 50 and older was the first to leave phase one. And uh, recently here on April 10th, it was phase two. And the final phase is uh, July 31. So, you know, I've been out of work. Unemployment doesn't pay anything. I've been trying to get this job with the Blue Garden going. Now, you too, once the channel is monetized, they pay for it. So, I'm not asking you to send me or give me money. I need you to subscribe and watch the videos because I need 1,000 subscribers 
and 4,000 viewing hours. And by reach, achieving that, I could get monetized. I could get money from YouTube, just like any other channel out there. So this is why I'm asking for your help. You know, I hate doing this, but hey, I try unemployment. It doesn't pay anything. I try looking for other new jobs. And guess what? Because I'm over 50, they hire younger people to do it. They, I... We already been to phase one, phase two uh, interviews, and in the end, they don't hire me because I'm, I got a lot of experience. I even told them, I don't even give them a salary. I lost three jobs because I asked for a fair salary and they didn't want to pay it. And then when they ask me, you know, what do you want? I tell you, uh, whatever you to offer me, I'll take it. And once they see how much experience I had and they calculate, which is illegal, they age discriminate. And I'm not the only one. I'm just recently learning a lot of stuff that these employers, they're not hiring older people because they think they're close to retirement. They're not going to work long. They're not going to work hard. And they'll sue them, which is not true in many of those cases. We just want to work, you know. But they don't hire us. They hire younger people with no experience because they could underpay them and take advantage of them. And if you don't think I'm telling the truth, ask around. Ask other people that you know. Now, in my last job, I was doing three different high-ranking jobs, you know, tuning inspectors, uh, um, tuning supervisor, that's a supervising job, tuning inspector, Another high ranking job and, and facility manager. There's another high ranking job. And you think they were paying me that kind of salary? No. So I'm asking your help to help monetize my channel. That's what I'm here for. So I put instructions in my new video coming out on Thursday. I hope you watch and understand why I'm doing this. I appreciate your help and everything you've done for the Blue Garden, the Blue Channel Garden. All right, thank you.